This is Twit. This is the Mesh Network. Amazon wants to create in all, it's really a ring product, I guess, which is also Amazon. Uh, the idea is a low band, it's called LoRa network that is can go two to five miles with the transmitters, but everybody who has a ring device or an Amazon Echo can be a hub and continue to spread that out around the neighborhood, ultimately putting a mesh over the entire neighborhood that could be used for geolocating. They've, their first product they announced was a mailbox sensor, but they said you'll never lose your dog again because you will know exactly where your dog is in the mesh at all times. I imagine Amazon also intends to put this in their delivery trucks. Maybe even, it's probably too expensive to put in packages because you need a transmitter, but this could be hugely valuable for Amazon's logistics as well. If you don't trust Amazon, how do you feel about the idea of an Amazon kind of wiring with you don't have to do anything. It's not it's not yeah. up to you wiring your neighborhood. Okay, so oh, Leo, I so whenever I'm with my my in-laws, I go around to the rooms that I'm in and I unplug all the echoes and dots because I don't trust them and all the Google Homes as well because my father in law likes technology. Oh, they must so hate you. <laughs> oh, I don't Alex has been here. He's stuck with Alex, me for I life. I support you. Like, my Thanks, our, our uh, seventeen year old will be eighteen in two in about a month. Uh, goes around putting all the Amazon uh, devices and the Google devices with the cameras face down. It just goes <laughs> around the house because he doesn't want to be spied on, and he turns off the Nest camera when he goes out on the deck. And it's like, yeah, well, I don't, yes. don't want to mean, look when you're on. No, I mean I, I I think I mean I refuse to have any of those devices in the house because I don't see the cost benefits. God, analysis. I'm just here with a bunch of luddites. How do you be in a technology podcast? You I mean, hate I've this stuff. Have, that we're all together, you know, joining hands in our anti-Amazon, anti-camera observation yeah. world here. This is great for me. Oh my well, God. well, no, I mean, uh, th this has been one of the things that working from home has really sort of um, made things interesting as a couple because Monica has heard me during my working day and has been kind of shocked about the amount of profanity which goes on in my day-to-day -day business. <laughs> I don't want he works for the Amazon. register, of course. It's well, no, I mean, I don't want Amazon or Google, or anyone else, listening in to me shouting and screaming at people. It's, okay, so I mean, let me ask obviously you: not... What do you guys do about this? Your cell phone—it's got a microphone, two or three cameras, it's got GPS, and it's always on the internet. What do you do about that? Do you? Well, that's the thing. I've already got a spy in my home. It's my iPhone. Well, you Why might as well get everything it? else. <laughs> No, that's not how spies. Alex, when you turn off your in-laws, all of their devices, do you also put your phone in a lead-lined box? Uh, no, I put myself in a lead-lined box and the phone on top, so I can still get tweets. <laughs> that's the that's the, <laughs> the correct way to do that. No, I look, Leo. It's like saying, "Oh, you've been shot once. Why don't you get shot a thousand more times?" It's the same thing. It's not. I I can try to have a more secure, safe, personal digital environment and not put cameras and microphones all over my house attached to companies with spotty track records about privacy. At least my phone, this is an iPhone 11 something, I don't know, someone can tell me what it is, it's got two cameras, not three, I don't think it's with bad ones. But like Apple actually has a reasonable history with privacy because they're not an advertising company. Amazon and Google are huge advertising companies. I don't trust them, I don't. Yeah, I mean, all it takes is about half an hour of work, you can lock down I mean, I'm a Pixel user. Uh, Nexus before that. I, I'm sold on Android. That's fine. But all it takes is half an hour of work. You can lock this stuff down. You can turn off the microphone. You can activate it with a simple button push. But I don't want a phone that's sustaining on me the whole time. And Google is making it purposely difficult to do that. But that's their business. It's so my business to get in their way. Compare and contrast you three with me. I turn on all beacons, everything. <laughs> it's all on. The network's on. Everything's on. Am I like somehow? Uh, what's is my life worse because of that? Has anything gone on? I can't. I've been doing this my whole life. I sit on camera twenty hours uh, a week. I show my home address. I show your home address. I, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still slightly mad about that. I'm so sorry. I apologize. I forget sometimes <laughs> that people care. I don't, don't feel like anybody. I'm it's suffering fine. because of that. The police haven't come and dragged me off. I'm not. I'm not in uh, Amazon prison. Uh, I don't get more ads but, than you do. But why give it up for free? You know, it's like yeah. this stuff is valuable. If they're willing to pay me for this stuff, fine. But why give it up for free? Why not? Also, it's precedent setting. 
Who's I think it is a slippery slope because I, when uh, Apple introduced Face ID to the iPhone, I was very against it. I was determined not to get the phone with the Face ID. I, I love Touch ID so much. And then I did get it. And I was like, okay, well, I'll turn it off when I go through airports. I'll be really careful. And lo and behold, I don't do that anymore. I'm very complacent with Face ID. And I think similarly, the more that we allow tech companies to encroach on our privacy, the more we'll just be like, oh, well, nothing bad has happened yet. I guess it must be okay. And that's how you get it. But what's going to happen? Damn right. Is Jeff Damn Bezos right. going to yeah, come to my house and force <laughs> force feed me Amazon products? I mean, we have Amazon selling data to uh, police departments and selling yes. face ID technology to the military. We yeah. have a situation that could, with bad actors, get completely out of control. Um, I would it, submit it, it, I, I agree if, totally if we yeah. have a situation like that, we have so much of a bigger problem than just the fact that you've got a lot of data online. If you've got a government that is at this point going to start dragging people off, you're, we're in much deeper trouble. And there are much more proximate ways they can grab you, including just taking you. Off the streets. No, it's, 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 I, I don't think it's. I don't think it's that serious. They're not going to be dragging people off the streets. They're going to be saying, someone will have a quiet word with you and say, "Look, we just happened to notice I'll that." You tell you what, those websites and the rest of that. Maybe you like might like to tone down your criticism of certain things. When that happens, you I know, will be the first to let you know. Um, also, one more nuance to this is like. Uh, uh, I want to have kids, and uh, I want them to be able to choose for themselves how much of their data is collected. Mm. And I'm going to be too late for my very... children, unfortunately. To and be that, clear, and but... that's when I agree with you, um, like 100. percent I wish I had shielded my children better. Uh, well, I've got yeah. to say, I'm, I, I feel phenomenally lucky to have grown through my teens and twenties in a time when digital photography was not available, because mm -hmm. my reputation would be trashed right now. Some of the pictures that could have been taken in those years, you know, and now it's all online. Everyone is sticking the stuff online and we're either going to have to come to a point where you understand what I hope is that we'll come to a point where people will accept everyone is imperfect and the rest of it because there's always evidence online. But I fear in the current puritanical streak of things and it'll, it'll be used against people. 